The title of this presentation is The Five Trends That I See Happening in the Workplace. And the first thing I see happening is that you will see more strategic alliances. There are companies like the Joint Venture Inner Circle, the Joint Venture Directory, and Strategic Alliance Live, where people can go on there and connect with other people who have similar services or have services that each other can benefit from and help each other grow their business. And this will only grow because as we do more business on the internet and growing a business on the internet is going to be the future of how business is being done. Because even if you have a brick and mortar store, you still need a website or you're losing money or leaving it on the table. And one of the things that I have found is by joining strategic alliances, I have been able to grow my email list. I've been able to grow my, my business exponentially. And the second thing that is going to be happening is that you are going to be seeing an increase of entrepreneurship because we all have specialties or a niche that we fill and we are truly becoming a global environment because if you look back on where we were a hundred years ago when there was an influx of Europeans into this country what did they do they sold their wares from a push cart on street corners but today we're doing the exact same thing on the internet through our e-commerce stores and you're going to be finding that growing more and more as time goes on and the third thing that you need to think about is digital marketing because growing a business online is very different than it is growing it offline yes you still need the networking yes you still need the strategic alliances but you also need to be able to use sales funnels to be able to use autoresponders to be able to be using a booking tool and you want something and a platform where you can find these tools and there is a lot of websites that you can choose from and they're all really good but you need to find one that fits your specific needs and that means doing what is going to help you grow your business now here's the thing if you're a graphic designer and you want to move on the internet then the best thing you can do is find a platform that has all these tools in one place that way you can set yourself up as a a web agency and you can go on sites like Fiverr or iWriter or almost any platform like Elance where all you have to do is sell your services what we are living in is what's known as the gig economy and this means that for anyone who has a business what you're doing is looking for opportunities to build a business now if you don't want to spend the time building a website and adding your your pictures of your products that you want to sell then you need to find someone that's going to do that for you so that's the fourth thing and the last thing we're going to need to think about that the trend is only growing is training and that training is an entrepreneurship because one thing that we find is colleges teach you how to go work for another company but they don't teach you the skills that you need in order to think like an entrepreneur and that's a specific mindset that you have so that's only going to be another trend that is going to be growing in the future because as we start putting together our online business we're going to need to learn how to 
work as a team with someone. We're going to learn, need to learn those leadership skills. We're going to need to learn time management skills. And there are platforms where you can go and get these courses that are specifically designed. And if you're, say, an accountant or a coach or even a, a consultant where there's certification involved, then there are certain platforms that you can go on where you can get those continuing education units. And it's like many people when they work for the corporation in the past, well, they gain those skills working for the corporation, but corporations don't hold you on long term and it's not a guaranteed job for life like it was when you had the the 50s and the 60s and the 70s because in the 80s and the 90s corporations merged they started looking for cost cutting ways and training was one of the things that they cut and then it in the latter part of the 20th century in the 90s was when you started seeing the buyout packages. So today there's no guaranteed job where you get to learn those skills, so you have to find a way to pick them up on your own.